Hey guys, how are you doing today? This is Clovis from the Fritz and Maker YouTube channel. What I would like to talk to you about today is this LCD menu that I created for you. Uh, I created a, an LCD menu. I decided to create that, create that, because lots of people wanna wanna get into Arduino to design products, to design solutions, not to learn the basics of electronics. So that people wanna start in with Arduino already designing products. And one of the things people use a lot to, to interface between the man and machine is an LCD menu, an, an LCD screen, sorry. And most of the LCD screen projects can have, or be, because of the uh, space and size limitation, they, they can have and they should have multiple screens. So that I created this project that, that easily implements um, different screens in in this case i'm going to show you six screens that i implemented uh, with this lcd so the lcd is a 16 um, columns by two lines that I, I bought on ic station or you can buy it on ebay or whatever bangod aliexpress it's very cheap it comes uh, it, it's an i squared c lcd it comes with a, a driver board which is this one in here so it, it only uses um, I, I squared C, as I said, SDA and SCL, and uh, of course uh, VDD, which is five volts, and GND, which is zero volts, directly straight from the Arduino. I'm, I'm, all, I'm also using an Arduino Uno with this uh, breadboard shield on top of it, and I'm, I'm using also uh, a button, a, like a simple switch in series with a 10k resistor to to make the the pull down stuff work. What this LCD does is, every time I press this button, a different screen is gonna show up. So this is the first screen, and whenever I turn the uh, device off, it's gonna show up in the first screen. LCD menu design, Fritz and Maker, slash lab. If I press the, the button in here, you're gonna see second screen of my menu, right? So this is the second screen. Hello world, third screen, three, third screen, right? This is screen four, just press a, a button. So this is fourth screen, fifth screen, I squared C L C D screen, and D last screen, sixth and last. What happens if I press this button again? It's gonna go back to the first screen and start start it all, all over. See, L C D menu design, Fritz and Maker, Fritz and Lab. Second screen of my menu. Hello world, third screen. So how did I do this? I used the Arduino IDE. I, I utilized the liquid crystal slash I squared C library and I utilize I, I also utilized the um, um debounce sketch for, for the button. So I, I put two sketches together and I, I created a little bit of code on top of that so that I created this this um, menu. And how do I do this? Um, every time I press this button there's one variable that increments. So from one to two, from two to three, and so on, up until six. When it gets to six, I, I created a, a logic that makes it go back to one. So so this is number four. I'm pressing, it's, it's giving number four for the program, number five, number six. If I press it again, it will go to seven, but I make it go back to one. So that this variable, the, the variable that has the number corresponding to the number of presses I make, um it feeds a let me see in here to show you it feeds in a switch case function on arduino so that case one it gets this screen the, there's a function i created outside of the loop function that said that is called first screen and then second screen third screen every time i press this button this variable uh, containing the number of press sends me to the uh, to the corresponding function first screen second screen third screen so on so on simple it doesn't use any delay it doesn't use anything special any 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 like any black magic or something it uses a switch case function it uses the debounce sketch which is present in the Arduino in the official Arduino IDE and it uses the um what's the name of it again liquid crystal i squared c sketch which you, which you guys can see okay um if you guys want to download this sketch and, and see how it works and use it and modify it, it's going to be in the description below, in the blog post of the description below. Um, 
This code is hosted on GitHub for free. It's open so so that you can guys clone, you guys can clone, you can you guys can use it, modify it, you guys can just use it however you want. This sketch is gonna work in any basically any Arduino because the like the Arduino language is, is sort of um, universal for any device running a, a Arduino bootloader. This switch is in the, in the uh, input number four of Arduino. And the LCD display, as I said, use A4 and A5, which, which are the, um, the I squared C pins for the, for the Arduino Uno in this example. Guys, I hope you like this video. I hope you, you share it. I hope you use it. I, I hope it, it is very, really useful for you. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel. And if you like, please buy this stuff. It's gonna, there's going to be a list in the blogs, uh, blog post down below. It's going to be a list uh, of all the components um, I use to assemble this, this experience from IC Station. Every time you guys buy from IC Station, which is where I, I bought those things as well, uh, I get more and more like I get more points and I can buy more, more stuff and I can show you that stuff. So every time you buy these things to experience this yourself, I gain, you gain back as well. See you later, guys. Bye bye.